Nikki got me up here doing things against my better judgment. <laughs> Holy cow. This is Nikki's first place. This is Pine Knob Shelter. It's an older shelter. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> uh, nothing too fancy. Right. I've never seen the ferns when they were fading like this. I've been up here early when they were sprouting and they're like curled like little fiddleheads. And you know, I've seen them when they were like lush and green. Never quite like this. Never been uh, on the Appalachian Trail in the fall before. She's so pretty. Like checking out the view here at Annapolis Rock and there's people rock climbing over there. Let's see if I can. A hawk? Oh yeah. Oh gorgeous. <laughs> so the leaves are pretty much peak in Ohio. Or, well, nearly there. Lots of orange. It's greener here, but I'm starting to see some of the reds. See, see the four hawks up in the tree? Well, three now. So Nikki informs me that those are turkey vultures because hawks don't squat up like that. Some good fall colors. So we just stopped and had a nice little break in this nice little spot. He's beautiful. There's the sun. Good fall colors. Definitely. Can you see that path down there at the bottom? Like right. Oh, I can't zoom in. There. There. <laughs> That reminds me of hiking the AT in Pennsylvania. Like, I'm surprised that's not the AT.
We are at Pogo Memorial Campsite. That's Nikki's tent there. And then mine is back there. It's a little harder to see. It's not this bright sunny yellow. And then let me swing this around slowly so as not to make anyone seasick. And here is our little fire pit. And this is, this is home for the night. So we hiked to Pogo from Annapolis Rocks and um, on the way here, we encountered, you know, what was supposed to be the water source and it was completely dry. So, um, but I've been here before and I remembered a spring down the Thurston and Griggs Trail that intersects the AT. So we went to check that out. Um, and luckily that spring was running. Um, not like I've seen it before. I've seen it, you know, gushing before, but uh, it was good water. Um, and we had that. So if that had been dry, we probably would have had to turn around and go back to Annapolis Rock and um, fill up at the spring there. And then probably would have, probably would have camped there. And that would have added, you know, just made tomorrow longer. So tomorrow there is no water for sure um, the whole day. So we have to make it to the next shelter. And hopefully the water there is um, flowing. And if it's not, we'll be okay because I think it's like, I don't know, maybe two miles down the road there's a Dollar General or something. So. We're gonna be fine. The sun is almost down. It's the view from the tent. I was gonna turn this around, show us, but I think, yeah, <laughs> we're just total darkness in the tent, but we're snuggling. So this is the first time there's ever been two people in my tent. It's been all that effort <laughs> up the tiger wall. Right? Here. Yeah. Now, right now, you're probably like, why the heck did I carry that tent <laughs> all day? Just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, live and learn. Mm -hmm. I just love the way they're all clustered up there. Like doing so well, <laughs> living their best life up there. So there's a little bit of view off to the right, and then, oh, did you see that bird? Went flying by. That is also, if we could see over there, it would be like <laughs> a drop off, but we're on a pretty narrow ridge line right now. I think that's all the view we're getting today. Well, I've never climbed up that pile of rocks. He got me up here doing things against my better judgment. <laughs> oh wait, that's video. Hang on. Yeah, it, it, it is. If you're not in a hurry, it is kind of fun. Yeah. I agree. Uh. Yeah, you can. It's hard to see on uh, video. It doesn't really. You can't tell the depth. There you go. Hasn't quite been our eyes yet. Spider web in the sunshine. We're getting ready to go up and over.
Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I still feel that way all the time. I, I, I'm still not done with this trail, you know? I gotta do, I really gotta go back and do the spots in Pennsylvania that I skipped. And yeah, someday I'm gonna do New Hampshire and Maine, one way or another. I'm gonna get her done. <laughs> I wonder what type of bush that is. I don't know. There are smaller ones too, but they haven't started changing colors. Well, we made it to our intended target, that Ensign Philip Cow Memorial Shelter. And the springs are almost dry. Just the teeniest, tiniest little trickle. And yeah, that's what's up. So this is a pretty nice shelter. Um, let's see. There is a bear box. There's a bear, a bear pole, but there's also a bear box right on the ground to the left of it. Um, there is this... It's a Nazi AT fireplace, and this porch is pretty new within the past, I don't know, couple years, I think. There's a picnic table, there is um, a second um, story, there's some things people have left behind. This is like, I don't know, a tablecloth or something. Probably somebody was using that for a windscreen or something. Um, yeah. The last time I was here in April, and this is now October, there was a bunch of firewood cut and stacked behind this shelter. Though that may have gotten used up over the summer, or they may have thought better of it. Yeah, that's gone. Um, I think there was a homeless guy living here. Um, there were some reports in Far Out of some pretty disturbing behavior going on. So I imagine they're probably not wanting to make this too comfortable. Though it is comfortable. It's a, it's a very nice shelter. It's the first one I ever, ever, ever slept in. On my very first back packing trip on the AT. So it holds a really special place in my heart. I'm not sure what that's for there, but it'd be great for uh, cowboy camping on. Here is to the Appalachian Trail. All right, what are we testing to? Waynesboro. Waynesboro, PA. Woo! <laughs> mm. Famous Wayne's Burgers. Woo! <laughs> this is the view from High Rock. Every time I've been here before, I've been alone. I was so excited to be able to bring Mike and Nikki up here to see it with me. Sometimes you just really want to be able to say, look at that. No graffiti. I'm not usually big on graffiti, but it works here because it's hopefully limited to this rock.
where you're going.